Well, there was a whole lot of reasons why I ended the program, but what I really discovered is my life wasn't working the way I wanted it to work. And there were a whole lot of things that happened in the last couple of years that really made me aware that I needed to change something because uh, I felt stuck. And what drove me was that I, I, I had such a difficult time accessing my own feelings. And I felt there was a veil between me and my life. And I knew that if I could learn to feel, that that veil would lift. First of all, Core Energetics brings certain keys to the table for most people, a way to responsibly handle and take responsibility for their lives and their negativity and what's not working to get a deeper understanding of why things may not be working. So it's more group focused and more freedom focused and more radical. I felt very scared and I didn't know what I was getting into, but it also felt like the right place to be. And then um, I walked into my group and had there was like an explosion. <laughs> it was pretty wild, you know, right from the beginning. It was very radical. The people who come to this school are already powerful people. The school attracts very powerful people. When you talk about core energetics, it's an energy. And it's based upon feeling, but, it, but it's bigger than that. The soul of it is that it, it takes on, an, on, a, on a level that gets beyond us because it has, has a universal sense of what this means for being human. And that's the treasure, is going beyond. It's really helped me to understand the patterns in my life and where those patterns have come from. And it's given me a choice about how to create new patterns and make different choices. I'm, I'm not so reactive to things that come, come my way in life. The emotional intensity of what goes on in this community is like nothing I've ever experienced before. And the people who come here and do this work, they're all so incredibly courageous. Right? It takes a lot of courage, it takes a lot of heart, because you're confront, you're, man, you, you will confront your deepest fears for sure. And just, I mean, just the idea of that, just the thought of that, I'm gonna go to a place and I'm gonna confront my deepest fears over and over and over and over again. But when you come out the other side of that, I mean, life is so much less scary. I'm able to go out in the world and feel a lot more open, a lot more free. There's just a, an enormous feeling of possibility. The only limits to, to what I can do or what I can accomplish are, are self-imposed. They're just, they're inside me. That the world, these limits that I thought were outside of me, I can't do this because, that's all nonsense. It's all, it's all in here. And once you understand that on a deep level, right, you're free. This school has given me um, a, lot of, a lot of space to tolerate the unknown and uh, a, a solid journey towards uh, accepting all different pieces of myself, which in turn allows me to be a lot more compassionate for others. It's like everything is allowed. So I didn't have to edit anything, and I was supported in that place. Like I was allowed to bring everything. In doing that, you know, if everybody does that, and everybody stays open to all of that, you end up in real relationships. Come here and claim all of your power and all of your aliveness and go back out and give it to the world.